hey, if I'm gonna go out there and look for that fish of a lifetime, I mean, go after a world record, you gotta go when the big fish are on the prowl. And bass especially, they're low light feeders. So days like today, you can see right now, I've got a nice cloud cover day. It's starting to rain a little bit. This is when the big ones bite. So I'm gonna go out there with the rigs that catch big fish on these conditions, you know. And my favorite, without a doubt, a big swim bait. Hard to beat, rig it with a power lock plus hook like that. It's weedless, you can reel it through the cover. Big fish come out to play on these kind of days. So what I wanna use is a must add power lock plus uh, swim bait hook with a hollow body swim bait like this Shadalicious right here. This is a five inch Shadalicious and you know big swim baits catch big fish and it's got a screw lock on the nose that really holds that bait in position. So I just screw that right into the, into the head of the bait and then kind of lay the hook against it and run it all the way through so that hook's exposed and it lays right against the top of the body like that. So I can throw this through the grass, the brush, lay downs, things like that, and it's perfectly weedless. And another neat thing about this particular hook is it's got a weight system that you can actually slide up and down the hook. So if I want the bait to run deeper, I keep the weight all the way forward on the hook. If I want the bait to run a little shallower, I can run it farther back and it'll ride higher in the water column. Swim baits catch huge bass. If you're looking for a world record, a swim bait is the way to go. Never leave the house without the big crankbait. I mean, I've, I've caught so many giant fish on crankbaits over the years that it's something that I'm always gonna throw. Days like today, that's when the big fish are on the move and they're gonna chase a moving bait like this big crankbait. I've got the hooks changed to KVD Elite Treble, so when I get that bite, I'm gonna hook and hold that world record fish. And the one thing that I learned is that standard trebles just don't cut the mustard. You gotta have something that's super strong and is gonna hold those big fish. I mean, if you get that world record fish on, the fish of a lifetime, don't skimp on your hooks. What I do is, you know, on a bait like this 6XD right here, it comes with standard round bend number twos. And I've had so many times where even a three or four pounder will flex that hook. Uh, that's why I designed the KVD Elite Triple Grip to be the way that it is. It's one extra strong wire, and with that extra short shank, I can put much bigger hooks on there. Instead of that number two, I go straight to a one-aught KVD Elite treble, and I just start the other one off the split ring and just run it right off and change the front one. I've changed just thousands like this, just using a standard pair of pliers, or you can use split ring pliers to do it. But that way, you don't take a hook off and put another one on. I'm, I'm, I'm doing it all in one swift process right there. So now I've got a 6XD and it's got two one-aught KVD Elite trebles. So when I get that giant fish on, these hooks aren't gonna flex. They're ultra points, so they're super sharp and I'm gonna land that giant bass. Crankbaits, big fish baits, make sure you got the right hooks on there.